sneezing, <laughs> coughing, <laughs> wheezing. Yup, it's that time again. It's going to be a bad one, I'm telling you. With all this wet weather and precipitation, the trees and the plants are thriving, but that also means it's going to be very green and there's going to be a lot of pollen this year. To help relieve those allergies the natural way, we spoke with Dr. Julie Wendt, physician at Relief Allergy, Asthma and Hives. Starting with lifestyle changes. Avoidance of allergies involves minimizing your exposure. If you're pollen allergic, it's outside. If you're dog or cat allergic, that's inside. So spending most of your time in that opposite scenario. You can also do some things around the house for environmental control. Closing the doors and windows, let the air conditioning and heating do the work for you. Changing filters on a monthly basis so that the pollen count is decreased in the house. Taking off shoes when you walk indoors so that you're not tracking pollen through the house and then environmental changes like moving carpeting to hardwood floor that's easier to clean and isn't going to concentrate that pollen in one spot. Next, try a sinus rinse. I also mean rinses of your actual target organs. Eye rinses for people who are eye allergic, sinus rinses for people who have nasal allergies. The best to use is a sterile buffered saline. Saline is a great hydrator and cleaner and antibacterial. You want to make sure it's gentle so that it doesn't leave any water in the sinus areas because it can get stuck when your sinuses are congested. Next up, keep your vitamin and micronutrient levels normal, which you can get checked at your doctor. We have evidence that when patients are low in vitamin D, they can have issues with allergies because it has an important cofactor function in the immune system and the cells need it to continue normally. This is the same for your zinc levels. We correlate zinc deficiency with asthma flares and it's actually used to treat severe asthma flares in the emergency department routinely and has been for years. There are maybe others that are important, but these are the ones that we really have strong evidence for and I can categorically say you need to watch these. She also recommends eating clean organic products free of pesticides. And if it seems like there is no end in sight with your allergies, ask your doctor about allergy shots. We're relieving your allergies the natural way.